So um, we appreciate you know, all what you're doing to keep the company growing because that's exactly, um, without you, we wouldn't be where we are today. So thank you for all that you do. But, you know, it really is, we have a lot of fun at the company. I was telling, sharing with Valerie and uh, Franz last night that, you know, I don't feel like I work because I get to come out with you guys and, and you know, when I'm, even when I'm at the office, I don't feel like it's work because I'm very committed and you have about 1,500 employees just in my building that support you. Just in my building. We have several buildings in Dallas, but the corporate office itself is about 1,500 employees and you know, you have all kinds of people that are committed to your success. So we're providing tools and making product and doing things that are going to make you successful, help you be successful. And you know, when I started 18 years ago, um, we had uh, our, you know, our product line is we specialize in color cosmetics and skincare, right? And fragrance too. But when I started, we used to sell shampoo, conditioner, and a hairspray. Yes. Right? Yes. And so we had a hairline, and so did I. <laughs> and they're both gone. <laughs> but uh, we're going to continue to produce products that will help you and, and, and sell themselves. So, so be sure to know that you're um, in, with, associated with a great business. And those of you that are thinking about joining or, or you're here tonight as a guest, just want to know a little bit more. I hope that you understand how great this company is. You know, we've got... Um, Right now, we have 650,000 consultants in the U.S. Wow. Worldwide, we have 3 million. Wow. Yes. In the U.S., we have 650,000 consultants. We have 12,000 sales directors. So you saw the people that were up here earlier? 12,000 sales directors. And we have 220 national sales directors. So... I say that because when you're around your directors and you're around the people that are building your business, the star consultants, the red jackets, the people that are earning cars, new directors, all the way up to national, you're surrounded by greatness. People that have made the, deci made the decision to step out of the crowd. There's 650 consultants, but they have decided to separate themselves into a different class, a different league. Of, of success and leadership in our company. So I want you to really think about what you could be doing now to prepare yourself for that. You know, you could really, if you think about it, you could really change your title from consultant, or not even a consultant, you consultant, to sales director, really, from now to the end of the year. You really, all it takes is for you to make a decision and get your skills up so that you can help people build their business while you're building yours. And if you think about, we have this party going on in New Orleans in January, and everyone here is invited to attend. You only need eight people on your team, eight people. My goodness, I think we're in New York City, aren't we? I think we can find eight people, right? So if you're thinking about leadership in our company, Eight people is all you need to get there. Ten is really what you want to do so that you're a director in qualification. You do want to become a sales director and earn that bag. Do y'all think that bag is slamming or what? Yeah. So you'll come and you'll get the bag and there's, we have all kinds of fun and parties and stuff lined up. But what I was saying about the 220 um, national sales directors, which is what um, Valerie, the national sales director Valerie Bagnall is, she is at the very top of our business. And we've got three other people that are right on the, on the brink of building their own national areas. And I want to give them um, some recognition. Like, Nova Smart Smart. What did I say? Nova Smart Smart. Jackie Alford and Alan Smith. And Lorraine, that means next time I come, you're going to be an elite or a national by then, right? We need you. So congratulations to all four of y'all of you for, for what you're doing to, to um, enrich the lives of people and also build that national area. And I'm happy to say, you know, we have 220 national sales director, directors, and as of the end of September, the Bagnall area ranks number 10. So, so that's why I was trying to explain to you, 
know, that's a big deal. So you're associated with greatness, and whether you're in the area or you're an adopted director, it doesn't matter, you're here. And so, so be open to the possibilities of what you can have for yourself through your Mary Kay business. You know, you really are surrounded with people that know how to work the business, that are successful in the business, and, and can really help you have a different life for yourself. You know, it's just like when Mary Kay started her business, she had a lot of reasons why not to do something, right? We always have reasons why not to do something. But isn't it, isn't it better when you feel those feelings of, gosh, I really, I really, I'm not sure about this, or maybe I just put it off till tomorrow, but then you end up doing it anyway. Don't you feel much better for having done it? What if Mary Kay would have not opened doors? You know, we wouldn't have had the kind of success um, that we have, and, and she's a, a trailblazer, she's a history maker, and you think about 50 years later, we are still growing, and, and we're just starting. We are just launched new products, the Mary Kay Act Play and the Clear Proof, and there's so many great new products coming out, you're gonna be great, you're gonna, you're gonna be so excited with all the new stuff coming out this quarter and next year too. So we're gonna continue to be great at what we do, and we need you to partner with us to build the business. And you know, you have your fall advance coming up, right? Yes. How many of you are going to that fall advance? Yes. All right. And those of you that haven't made up your mind, I hope you do make up your mind tonight to be there because you know the president of Mary Kay is going to be with y'all. I said the president of Mary Kay is going to be with y'all. That's Mr. Daryl Overcash, and you know he doesn't. He only picks. He only picks two or three events each year. Yeah, so you're pretty special. So keep that in mind. You know, when you qualify to take a picture with him, you do want to do that because that doesn't happen all the time. So you need to know that because you're growing and because you have so much success and there's so much greatness going on in your area, he's going to fly out and spend some time with y'all. So you need to get there, register, and make sure that you attend that event. All right? So let's, let's talk about New Orleans. So New Orleans is fun, right? How many of you have been to New Orleans? How many would like to go to New Orleans? How many would like to go to New Orleans as a sales director? Right, because everything, at Mary Kay, we do everything up. We do it right, we do it good. And a lot of y'all, I, I was walking around earlier and telling y'all, come look at the jewelry. I brought the seminar jewelry. And a lot of people are afraid to come touch it. It's great. <laughs> don't be afraid of it. Put it on and take a picture with it. That's why I brought it. And I know it's not, and we've never lost a piece of jewelry at any event, so I'm not even worried about that. So come up and take a picture, really. I mean, that's why it's there. But, you know, and, and if, if the jewels don't get you going, you know, it, it's okay. You know, think about when you become a sales director, you can really, really change your title. You know, how many of you have a job? Yeah, um, a lot, okay. So you think about, you go to that job, you might want a different title, right? But what do you have to do to change your title? You have to wait for that person to leave, right? There has to be an opening. You have to apply for it. You have to get interviewed for it. And then if they like you, then you get offered the promotion, right? Isn't that how it works? Well, in Mary Kay, you can decide to change your title. And all it takes is for you to make that decision of what you really want. You know, leadership is, is really um, something that you probably do whether you have a title or not. You know, you could be a leader within your family, you could be a leader in your community, you could be a leader um, at your school or whatever it is that you're doing. You're already a leader. But Mary Kay, you start your business and you can lead others along with yourself to greatness and to success. And we all need to make money, right? Everybody needs to make money. You might as well do it with Mary Kay because you, the sky's the limit. You can decide what you want to do with that and change your title. So sales directors, if you're sitting in the audience today wondering how many people you're going to bring to leadership conference, think about if you're, if you're a, a, a director, you can change your title by the end of the year and become a senior. Seniors can become, with two or three people, you can become an executive within a matter of months. 
If you identify a few more people that you want to work with, get through DIQ, by March, career conference, you can have two or three more, you're going to be an elite. And what's next? National. national sales director. And I can tell you, with 220 national sales directors, there's definitely room at the top. Right? So, so really, I want you to, everyone here, I want you to dare to dream of what it is that you could have in your life. You know, it really is an opportunity that you have in front of you that not everybody has. Not everybody has a chance to really take their business and do something big like that. If you were to put 30, 40 hours into your very pay business, imagine what it would do. Imagine the returns, the sales. And, and then you, people see you making money and having fun. I mean, everybody has enjoys making money, right? So you're going to attract people to you as you're enjoying your business. It's a fun business. And, you know, when you think about all of the products that are out there, there there's, there's so much that we offer through our product line that it's going to be easy for you to sell. You, you can find something that you're good at and then just improve your skills and build your business. And so I invite you to do that. I invite you to think about what you can have when you do that. Because when Mary Kay started the business, she started with her life savings of $5,000 to open the business. And today we're sitting here with $3 billion in sales. So and we're, we are in 37 markets, so we've got people and, and we're expanding more and more. So it's a global company and it's a solid company and I really um, think that this is really um, the, the best thing that's out there. And, uh, and, and I, you know, when you think about what what people do to grow their business, it really is just honing the skills, learning the product, and then passing on the opportunities. Because that's what Mary Kay invited us to do. She invited us to pass on the opportunity. And I get um, the privilege of working with the top nationals and top directors uh, and people building the national. Um, and, and I get to see what happens when a person is decided. You know, and when a person decides to take a course of action, and does it repeatedly, 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 it really is, that's the key to success. You have to make the decision and then do the activity behind it. You know, we just went to China a couple, um, last month, feels like a long time ago, but it was just last month we were in China where we took the national sales directors and the top sales directors on the trip. And you know, when I was climbing the Great Wall, I kept thinking about your business and I kept thinking about, um, how it is that when you first, I just first wanted to get to that first level on that wall. I just wanted to get to that first level because I could see it. I could see that level. I thought if I could just climb a few steps, and I've been working out and stuff, so I was able to get up there pretty quick. It's pretty easy. But when I got up there, I saw two or three more little landing areas. And I thought, okay, well, I'm going to get to those. And as I reached each one, you know, some of it was harder to get up to that next level on the great wall. You know, they're all stairs that go up. So some, some stairs were short, some were, were longer, some had grooves, some were, you had to stretch to get up to that next step. That next step. But the thing is that I kept, I persevered and I kept doing it and I kept doing it and I'd get higher and higher and higher. Before I knew it, there was only a handful of people that were still climbing to the top. And we're rallying each other and taking pictures and enjoying the view and, and just stopping to look at how magnificent the world can look from the top. And I kept thinking, if I could just get one more and then one more and higher and higher, I ended up getting to the very top eventually. Yeah, thank you. And it turns out that there was 13 of those landing areas, which in Mary Kay, 13 is a lucky number. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah. And, uh, and we had a dinner there for, for all the, everyone that was there. We had a great dinner on the Great Wall. And, and, you know, when we were up at the top looking down, you know, I kept thinking, uh, really the only way to get there was I had to make the decision to really get curious about going up to see um, the, the view from that landing spot. But once I was there, I could see a little bit more, right? Then you see a little bit more and more and more until you decide, I'm gonna keep going and go to the top. But it really wasn't, it really wasn't that it got 
harder necessarily. Some of it was hard, but some of it was, went faster, right? Because if the steps were shorter and shorter from one fork to the other, you could go faster. But then sometimes it got longer, but you still went forward anyway. And it wasn't that it was difficult, it was that I persevered. Yes. Made the decision, persevered, made it, to, made it to the top eventually, and I had people supporting me and rallying with me along the way. That's exactly what happens in your Mary Kay business. And I can tell you going up to the top was just, it was magnificent. The view from the top is the best. So I want, I want, to, I want you to think about that and, and think about, it really is that once I learned the skill, which is I can walk, I just did it over and over and over. And it was just telling myself, keep going, keep going, keep going. And so I invite you to do that with your Mary Kay business. And those guests that are thinking about doing this, just try, it's $100. It's only $100 if you decide that you do want to join the company, check it out. I mean, you'll get more products than, than what you invested anyway. And, you know, I don't know about y'all, but I could use a little bit more products. <laughs> but I know y'all look great. Um, but I did want to um, share with you that, you know, on that trip, our CEO, his name is David Hall, and he, he gave us a quote in his, he gave us a 10 minute speech. And, um, in his quote, he asked, he, he said, and kind of asked us the question, today is the youngest you'll ever be. It's also the oldest you'll ever be. So what are you going to do with it? We only have today to make a difference. We only have today to impact what happens. Find a reason why you want to and need to grow your business or to start a business. Because that, that that's going to motivate you to continue to build and grow. You know, you can change your plot in life. You know, we talk, I talked about going to China. We took people on a trip to China that qualified. You know, they already made money, right? The directors of National already made money. That was just an extra gift in addition to jewels and things. You know, you really can't have anything that you want through the Mary Kay business. And it just, you just have to allow yourself time to dream and really think about what you can have when you make a decision and you go after it. And so, I, I, you know, I, I want you to think about um, what you can have and, and, and what is it that you want to obtain and what could you change the life of your children or of your parents or um, of, of whatever your motivation is to do that. You can have it all through your Mary Kay business. And uh, you know, I want to leave you with a thought. And, and that is, um, you know, if Mary Kay hadn't have done, started this business, where would we all be? We wouldn't be here. We wouldn't know each other. We wouldn't be in this space. You can't start today and have a new beginning. But you can start today and have a new ending. So let's end it great. And again, congratulations to the stars. Thank you so much for having me. Love you guys.